Hey guys and welcome back. So today's video I am going to show you guys how to use a mini eyelash curler. I'm going to be using this mini eyelash curler from M Lash and I'm going to show you two different ways to use it. One without lashes, false lashes and the other with lashes so stay tuned. Alright so first things first, one thing I do want to stress out, you do not have to do this but I really highly recommend doing this well, not doing this, is using any kind of mascara before curling your lashes. Only reason why is if you put on any kind of like a base or anything on your lash and it's still wet, you kind of run the risk of ripping your eyelashes out. So don't do that if you don't have to. Um, I know some of us struggle with really tiny lashes, but trust me, use the lash curler first and then go over it with the mascara. So I'm going to show you the difference between the two eyelash curlers. So this is a average eyelash curler that you can pick up anywhere. This is my M lash one. This is probably probably my favorite one that I've ever used. And this is just a mini eyelash curler. So you want to make sure you get something that fits you best. To me this fits me really really good only because I wear false lashes and um, I really, really, really like to get really good into the crevices and as close as possible to the base of my eyelash only because it's really hard for me to see and I wear long nails so using a little device like this really, really helps that. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and curl both um, sides of my lashes and I'm going to show you the difference with and without them being curled. So this is my lashes without them being curled and you want to make sure you're holding the uh ooh, i'm holding it wrong sorry so you want to make sure you're holding the rubber part towards the ba the bottom of the lash and then the other side that you're going to squeeze down um that should always be pointing to the top so if you see correctly this is exactly how you want to do it um in this position but of course facing your eyes so now i'm just going to go as close as i can to my lash line and squeeze down and squeeze down and move it over and squeeze down like so now I'm just gonna go in with my mascara so make sure you're doing your mascara after not before Alright, so both eyes I use mascara and you can actually see the difference how curled this one is and how just normal this one is. I only curled this side and I didn't curl this side but I actually put mascara on just to show you guys the difference between the two. So you can see these are way more flirty and curled and this one is just just regular without doing anything. So, as you Okay, so my lashes are on. They're not completely dry so you want to be very, very careful that your lashes have dried up almost fully because like I said before if you use something if if your lashes are wet and then you go ahead in with a contraption like this you run the risk of pulling off your lashes and you do not want to do that so just be very very careful that your lashes dry um, pretty much completely before you do anything so now I just like to bind my false lashes with the real lashes and this helps because like I said I wear long fake nails and I never ever ever can get this correct because it's just it, it just always comes out so messy so this comes in handy when you have fake long nails like me so just press and press and press and bind all your lashes together and that's it perfect so we're gonna do it again on this eye press Press and bind. Easy. So if you have, sometimes your lashes will go on and one one side will look kind of more crooked and not as um, flared out at the other as the other. So you just go ahead and go in and you can fix that real easy with this. 
Alright guys, so now you know how to use the mini eyelash curler from M Lash. You can use it with or without false lashes. It's so quick and easy to use. And it's actually better, a little bit better than using, especially when it comes to false lashes. Because when you look at this eyelash curler, it's really hard to use. Especially when you're like me and you like that nice, long, dramatic um, false lash. It's really hard to get in there with using this. So this comes in handy. I mean, it's like a no-brainer. And for those of you who freelance like myself, this is the bomb. I'm telling you, this is so much easier than using your tradi traditional eyelash curler. Like, it's a no-brainer. So I will link a, leave a link down below just in case you guys want to try this out for yourselves. And yes, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. Bye.